Robotics, coding, aerospace technology. Sounds like classes that college students would find, but some middle schoolers are taking these courses. News Center 7's Caroline Reinwald live in Beaver Creek with how a middle school is offering classes that could really help kids' future careers. Caroline? Well, James, this is the first year that Beaver Creek City School District partnered with the Greene County Career Fair to offer a very special class right up here on the second floor at Jacob Coy Middle School. So this is our robot right now. Cooper and Tim have been working for weeks. We have four-wheel drive, and then we have two Cortexes. With one goal in mind. We're really just trying to make it as fast as we can. On their first test run, things went a little awry. We're going to have to fix that when we program it. It's been very neat to see uh, the kids just latch on and buy in to this type of program. And then it can roll its wheels backwards. Students in Greg Haynes's class get to choose what they want to build. All we have to do is attach this. I think I want to build like a race car or something. And how to make them work. And we're using Suedo code which is how you get the robots to be programmed. The goal is to give them hands-on experience with aerospace, robotics, and flight technology. It's been awesome. Uh, the teacher's amazing. The class is awesome. It's fun. I like building and having hands-on, so I really enjoy this. They can become independent thinkers and then stay here locally and, and hopefully uh, get jobs in the area. I've enjoyed it a lot. It's like really fun and you can be creative and there's like no boundaries to what you can do. As for Cooper and Tim, after a few tweaks, <laughs> things began to straighten out. Like I made this, like this is working. And I think everything went very well. Haynes tells me that the Career Center and the district are working to add an aerospace technology or an engineering class at the high school in the next year or two. Reporting live in Beaver Creek, Caroline Reinwald, News Center 7. As we 